sustainable living out at sea and on land. Um, it's just a beautiful feeling to catch your own food. And if you're a vegetarian, um, you probably don't want to watch us kill animals. And we don't like to, but we'll do it to feed ourselves. It's called sustainable living and hunting. And we only kill what we can eat and freeze. And that's it. We're not like mass murdering the whole ocean and land. And yes, I've gotten a lot of um, criticism for some of my videos because we kill beautiful animals and all creatures are beautiful. So it's what we can eat and what's legal and that's there's plenty of in the ocean and on land. So hobo simple rustic cooking. Love it. It's a beautiful feeling to be able to hunt your own food. You're self-sufficient. So if anything happens in this world, um, we can take care of ourselves so I just love that feeling and for all the hypocrites that eat meat and buy meat at the supermarket unless you're a vegetarian I can understand that that you love life and I love life too but I eat meat but for everyone that eats meat and they buy meat think about where you're getting the meat from who kills the meat just because you didn't kill the meat doesn't mean that you're any less guilty if you paid for the meat and you ate the meat and you don't know how it's killed, think about it. Everything that you put in your mouth, animal-wise, someone's killing it. And if you're paying for it and you're eating it, you're as guilty. So that's just my say on the people saying that it's so horrendous to be hunting and shame on us for killing a beautiful animal and eating it when our bellies are full. Um, we try not to buy as much food if we can catch it ourselves. So thank you for watching. Do you hear the crackling yummy? Ooh, crispy. Really dangerous working with boiling oil, being, <laughs> being naked. <laughs> We're naked. Okay, he closed the oil, so I need to go with blue. Okay, while pause scores it in tiny pieces. I'll show you what I do. So, take the vermicelli and use my fingers, of course. It's still a little bit warm, but that's okay. Like pasta. That's sort of a lot. But this is much lighter than pasta. Vietnamese. Well, all Asian countries eat this. Ooh, hot. Um, I might have to turn off. Okay, I'm going to turn off this. So, Paul is putting the crunchy coral trout. You can use um, fillets of fish, but since we're eating the spine, because we hate wasting anything, um, so most people won't be doing this. Just whatever fish. Any vegetables. Um, bean sprouts are really good. I um, sprout my own bean sprouts, but I haven't um, for the last few days, so we don't have bean sprouts. I also like to put fresh chilies. We don't have any fresh chilies. <laughs> so it's um, sustainable living with what you have on board too. So it's a mix. And it saves a lot of money. And it's not just saving money. It's just how can you fucking get any fresher than this? It's so good. And look at this. Nature's bounty. It's so abundant when you're not green. If you like Gypsy Christine channel, please click subscribe. I'll show you more fun, crazy adventure travel videos. And thank you for watching. Very healthy. Mmm. We eat it with the vegetables on the bottom. And this is a very healthy way of eating. Thanks for watching.